Chapter 4, Mishnah 1. The next Mishnahs discuss the ways in which the poor collect peah. We now turn to the words of the Mishnah. Peah is to be given while it is still attached to the ground. In the case of the trellised grapevine and date palm, however, the owner brings down the fruit and distributes it equally to the poor, since it would be dangerous for the poor people to compete for the peya while climbing them. Rabbi Shimon says, so too in the case of the walnut tree. That too is dangerous for the poor to climb because of its smooth trunk, and the owner must therefore bring down its peya fruit and distribute it. The Mishnah goes back to its opening statement that the basic law of peya is for the owner to leave standing produce for the poor. Even if 99 of the poor people who are present say that they want the owner to cut down and distribute the peya to them equally, and only one of them says that he wants for them all to cut and grab as much as each one can, to this one we listen, for he has spoken according to the law. The owner must follow the wishes of the lone poor person who wishes for the poor to cut and take the peya themselves in open competition, because that lone poor person is insisting on following the law of Peya as it should be.